Hello, this is Mark Sabatella from Outside Shore Music, home of Mastering MuseScore. In this week's tip, I want to show you how you can change the sound that is used for the playback of chord symbols. MuseScore has supported playback of chord symbols for some time now, and it, it chooses a sound automatically that may or may not be what you want. So here I have an acoustic bass part, and I've written some chord symbols above. And it's using like uh, an acoustic guitar kind of sound for that, and maybe that's not really what I want. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the mixer. You can uh, use the button here on, on the toolbar or the keyboard shortcut F10. And once you've opened the mixer, you'll see that there's a channel here for acoustic bass, but next to that is a chords channel. And that chords channel uh, will let you choose the sound that is used for the chords. You'll see one of those for every instrument that actually has chord symbols. So it's set right now to acoustic nylon string. If I go to Muse Sounds, Muse, Muse Guitars, you'll see it's set there to nylon. I can change it to something else. I could change it to one of the electric guitar sounds, for instance, or I could just change it to a piano sound, or I can change it to really anything I want. I could change it to uh, one of a, a sound font. You know, any sounds that you have installed are available. I might want to try uh, the, the so-called suitcase piano, which is essentially a Rhodes Right? So whatever sound you want to have for the playback of chord symbols, you can select right here in the mixer for each channel that of for each instrument that has chord symbols.